Recently, we sat down with replacements frontman Paul Westerberg and shot the feces on a potpourri of subjects. Internal squabbling, alcohol problems, music videos, and rumors that All Shook Down was originally supposed to be a Westerberg solo album. Here's the poop from Paul himself. Making this record kind of differently by me going in first uh, freed me of the responsibility of thinking that I have to like write songs for the band, you know. And uh, it was good in the end that they came in and played, but uh, I didn't go in there with th that thought in mind. I, I was thinking maybe I would do it by myself, and uh, and it, it didn't turn out that way. But uh, you know, I think for the best. In People say this new record is mellow. It's like I defy anyone to find one shred of mellowness in these lyrics. It's like it's very uneasy and it's like, a, you know, it's broken glass stuff. So I'm saying these records are like, uh, what's the word, uh, transitional. And, and that makes it sound like I'm going to find something my niche one day and stick with it. It's like, this is my niche, that I do whatever I want. I guess I am the leader, and they looked to me to lead the band, and, and my one statement was, things were getting stale, and let's do something about it. And uh, if you don't know what to do, then I don't know either, so I'm gonna do this and see if this works. got us acclaim in the first few years because it was something to grab on. The band that had no image, well, they drank. You know, it was like George Michael's stubble. You know, it had nothing to do with the music or anything, but it was what they grabbed onto, and, you know, it was an albatross. We couldn't